It's something Purdue football fans have been calling for for a long time now. Newly named athletic director Mike Bobinski has decided to fire head coach Daryl Hazel after a 3-3 start to the 2016 Purdue football season. The news came one day after a homecoming loss to Iowa. After Coach Hazel posted a 9-33 record, Athletics Director Mike Bobinski decided the Boilermakers needed to head in a new direction. Unfortunately, the program just wasn't able to gain the traction uh, that, that, that I believe it can uh, and, and, and should at this point in time. Uh, so, so we made the decision, or I made the decision to, uh, to make the change. After consulting with President Daniels and uh, Board Chairman Mike, Mike Berghoff, uh, we decided to, to make this change. The athletics department has handed the responsibilities over to former wide receivers coach Jared Parker, who is ready for the new challenge. Well, it's um, starting to feel those right now. You know, it's just all happened pretty fast. But I think the uh, first challenge is you got a bunch of men in the room that you've coached with that are hurting because of what's happened because everybody's affected by it. So much of, uh, of men that I still share the office with and families. So that's a challenge and will continue to be a challenge. Uh, then the young men that are that are on our football team that are wondering who the next head coach will be, how's this going to change all the things for us, recruiting, all those things, uh, start to enter your mind about the challenges you're going to have in that, in that regard. And then the third thing is, is I have an obligation to Mike and Purdue University and those guys in that locker room and our coaching staff to make sure that um, we, we put our best foot forward in the last six games to do something that our seniors and the guys who are going to leave this program feel proud of. As the football program moves forward, many Purdue students have one name on their mind for who will take over next season. Well, uh, a lot of people are thinking Les Miles should uh, come in and be the coach, but I don't think that would be a good fit for Purdue because he's at the end of his career. He runs a very bland offense, and that's just not a good fit for what we want to do here. Personally, I think P.J. Fleck from uh, Western Michigan, who's 8-0 now, should come in with his fire-studded offense and uh, just energize his team and change the culture of Purdue football. I mean, I, I would prefer P.J. Fleck, yeah. but uh, I mean, that's kind of wishful thinking. I feel like he's going to have a lot of good offers, yeah. um, but he seems like he's like a high energy, high energy guy and like he'd bring a lot of good stuff to our school. As Coach Parker looks to lead the Boilers to a bowl game this season, Purdue fans anxiously await the future here in West Lafayette. Dakota Simon, Fast Track Sports.